Hi everyone, welcome back to Simply Innovation. I'll continue my previous tutorial about MQTT JavaScript based. So in the previous video, I created a simple MQTT broker using Mosca and also its client using MQTTJS. Now I'll connect my MQTT broker to MySQL database. So the data that published from my publisher will be saved on my database. Okay, let's get started. So I'll go to MySQL bin to activate my MySQL server. Open on terminal and I'll go to CD MySQL server bin. Or you can use uh, MySQL workbench or MySQL on PHP admin, etc. Okay, I'll activate using MySQL hyphen U username hyphen P enter the password and MySQL is activated. After that, let's create a database here. Create a database, I'll call it mqtt.js. Let's use mqtt.js. After that, let's create a simple table here. Create table, I'll call it mqtt.js. The first column is uh, ID, integer, not null, and it's just an incremental number, auto increment. The second column must be the message okay, from my publisher, must be varchar255, and uh, I'll also record the time, must be timestamp, uh, default, current, timestamp. Okay, just a simple table on my database. After that, uh, I, I should declare the primary key must be the ID. Okay, nice. Describe, let's see, my table. Okay, MQTTJS table on MQTTJS database consists of three columns, ID, message, and also time select asterisk from mqttjs there is no data okay nice okay so uh, next let's connect my broker so i'll connect my mosca mqtt broker to my SQL using my SQL package from javascript Okay, so just open the terminal and I'll install MySQL package for JavaScript npm install MySQL. Let's wait. After MySQL installed, let's insert on my broker.js. So I'll insert mysql setting the first one let's import mysql package require mysql like this uh, after that let's declare our database for example i'll declare a db variable consists of mysql dot create connection method insert uh, the host the database host is on my local host and then the username of my database it's lintang and then uh, the password 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 is 12345 and the database name mqttjs okay mqttjs right okay after that, let's connect to our database. Just type db.connect. Create a row things function here. Just console.log uh, database connected. Nice. 
okay after that uh, I will save the data published from my publisher so this is the data the message from my publisher right it will be saved on my database so I have to declare first uh, to ensure that the message is only pure the message from my publisher so I'll create if statement if the packet payload string I'll call it the message message equals this message if the message uh, that slice 0 1 is not equals to this and also if the message uh, that slice 0 4 is not equals to MQTT so it must be the pure message from my publisher I'll insert the message to my database using insert statement db stat insert into my table mqttjs set the data okay so the data is just uh, insert into mqtt i'll insert just the message column the data must be message message like this okay after that let's execute the database query db.query db statement data create a function data error and also the output for the parameter function if there is an error it will console.log the error message else console.log the output okay nice or I'll print data save to database. Okay, just like that. Okay, let's try to publish some data. Okay, let's open my terminal again. Split it into three parts. One, two, three. Okay, this is for my broker. This is for my subscriber, and the last one is for my publisher. Activate my broker node broker. Activate my subscriber node sub and node pub to publish a message every five seconds. Let's wait. Nah, hello world. Okay, okay, let's open my SQL database. Select, oh, still empty. There is an error here. I think let's close. Okay, so I think I don't have to declare the message here, just insert into MQTT JS set question mark. Okay, let's try again node broker node subscriber and node publisher let's try again okay wait every five seconds it will be sent the data okay nice hello world data saved to database data saved to database okay let's open my comment prompt database mysql type select asterisk from mqttjs nice this is the message from my publisher 
pub.js so like asterisk from mqttjs id message and also the time so it works we have connected our MQTT broker using Mosca.js to MySQL database. So that's it. A simple connectivity using MQTT broker, MQTT publisher, MQTT JS, Mosca, and also MySQL database. For full tutorial, you can check on my GitHub repo. Link is on description. And in the next video, I'll create a tutorial how to connect my MQTT broker to another database. NoSQL database, MongoDB. Thanks for watching. See you. Bye-bye.